What's going on, Techno Buffaloes Driven? Welcome to the Tech Feed. We've got a very special episode for you. We are live from Fisker Automotive's headquarters in Anaheim, California. We're gonna get a complete tour of their design process, how they go from sketch to actual car and everything in between, even have a glimpse of what's coming in Fisker's future. And coming next week, we're gonna have a very special first drive of this guy right here, the Fisker Karma. Let's get started. So we are here at Fisker's corporate headquarters in Anaheim, California. We have the distinct privilege of talking with one of the heads of the design team. We are here with... Alexander Klatt. Thank you for uh, having us. Thank you very much uh, for having us as well. So you're going to walk us through the design, what sort of brought us to the iconic Fisker Karma that we see today, from, from modeling to all the steps in between. Uh, so please walk us through it. Alrighty. I think the first step I wanted to, to um, start with is the very original clay model where we have sitting here, uh, what Henrik Fisker and Barney Köhler started in 2007 to outline what the combination of that beautiful styling is what Henrik was dreaming about, but also about the very sustainable low carbon footprint powertrain solution we work with. So what you see here behind me on that wall is a physical documentation of the masters of the components we released into production. And if you imagine there's so many parts in an interior and in an exterior to see parts which are the black leather in that case is black leather, uh, there's painted surfaces in black, there is molded in color like, like real plastic parts without a, a coating on them in black. So in here, in the daylight, we can review this, how the leather and other components live together. And if there's certain odd uh, combinations of coloring or in craftsmanship where you see certain, certain um, motions of the, the, the thread coming out in different environments in, 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 a, in a funny color, so that we can change even thread colors on that level. But we can also look how it would look in a showroom where you see more this this yellowish greenish type light uh, if that looks correct and then also when you drive in the sunset a way warmer light where we do the whole setup again we believe as a high-end luxury designer brand uh, we should have the control over the quality of the perceived quality. Everything which stimulates the senses of us, of our customers, we wanted to bring to a higher level and make this harmonious as an experience. So Fisker is well known for its design. There's a lot of effort that goes into making its models look the way they look. So we're going to walk through the process from original sketch to final production. We go really art. Uh, really paintings because what I want from a designer is more the essence of his theme. What you see here is the quarter scale model originally from the Atlantic and then in here we really define the surface language, the themes and we feel after about four weeks of working the designer with one sculptor uh, and they believe that's it, we scan it and then mill it full scale and what you can see here is then the full-size clay model. We built this seating bug, uh, which is pretty typical in the automotive industry. Uh, and basically, we bring the architectural elements which are relevant for the consumer into this bug. And so the ingress, egress of the A pillar, how we call that, the B pillar, how the door, the rocker is to get in, in, in and out of the car, uh, a rough idea where the dashboard is. If you hit the knee against the dashboard, you can see that uh, we model the door panel, the dashboard, the seat, the steering wheel, which is over there. The full interior, basically, in clay to make sure that when you sit in the car and the customer is driving, that every surface is modeled in, the, in, in its high, highest fashion of 3D sculpting, but ultimately the, the finished uh, property we built is this model where all exterior design development, all interior design development and also the color material work gets built up into uh, this model. We call it the feasibility prototype, the outlook into the f of our future. We're finishing up the funding right now and then we get going and build this Atlantic which will be an exciting car on the road beside of the Karma.
We shouldn't use that. That one hurt my arm. <laughs>